Live from Phoenix, Fox 10 News at 9 starts now. Put your hands on your belly and go. Oh, oh, oh! This Phoenix man is known as Santa Claus in more than just appearance. The deadly secret, though, hidden by his features. Fox 10 News at 9. Oh man, Fox, new technology is being used to attack throat cancer. For the first time, doctors are able to cut out cancer tumors so precisely, some patients don't need radiation or chemotherapy. The Mayo Clinic Hospital in Scottsdale is one of the few places in the country using this new upgrade, and Saber Gurch has the story. He's got the suit from red belly to boot. Santa Bob has been on the job now for 14 years. So I'm the one that's blessed. He is the real Please. deal. Put your hands on your belly and go, ho, ho, ho. His Santa spirit is as authentic oh, as his beard. <laughs> that's a great picture. This is me right there. One of this handful of Santas across the country with built-in white whiskers, who would have guessed that his prized Santa feature would disguise his disease? Dr. Handy comes in and looks at the film and comes over and starts rubbing my neck and so forth and he says well you've got a tumor <laughs> I says great what what, what chance is it uh, that, that I have uh, cancer he said 75 percent and he was right Bob's beard actually hid the stage 3 cancer swelling in his throat this is the lot that the Lord gave me in my life and it's, it's just throwing me a little curve and you jump on it, and you step on it, and you talk to the cancer, and you say you're coming out Monday. It's Monday at the Mayo Clinic. It's been available here what, a year. Dr. Michael Hinney is one of the few doctors in the country using something new to tackle throat cancer. Rather than taking people apart, cutting their jaw and moving it. He's using the OmniGuide CO2 laser. It's just a marvelous cutting tool as opposed to a knife or a pair of scissors. It starts with a hollow fiber optic cable, just a millimeter in diameter. Layers of tiny reflective mirrors coat the inside. Laser energy bounces through that cable, off those mirrors, and lands exactly where the doctor directs it. The light will be reflected through the hollow fiber, through uh, the layers of mirrors within it. The same energy you see spelling out a curvy hello, will cut out the curvy edges of Bob's tumor. And what I'm holding here and moving now is a fragment of his tumor. A tumor the size of a ping pong ball. It's invisible light. You can't see it. The OmniGuide is the most precise upgrade to laser technology attacking throat and neck cancers. For the first time, surgeons are able to look through a microscope and manipulate the energy wherever they want it to go. But when we're through here, there will be no cancer left at the primary site without this new upgrade which is malleable we can bend it and shoot at angles the co2 laser was limited it would only cut in a straight line of sight and could only be used on certain patients this gives us more capabilities and so there are very few tumors that we cannot approach through the mouth and remove on the table is bob's tumor this is essentially all cancer before the day is done a cancer mass in his lymph nodes the size of a tennis ball is pulled out and he says bob i got good news for you we don't have to shave your beard at all. <laughs> so I thought that was a good omen. Bob Grinnell specializes in finding good omens. He lost his son, Tony, in a car accident. Bob survived brain surgery a few years ago, and another accident took Bob's right leg. My brother, Santa, throughout the country have sent me cards. He's got a book full of cards. Here's some more. Thanking him for Christmas. He looks forward to many more. I think I have 20 more years of seeing um, several thousand kids every Christmas. So. Now, two weeks after this interview, and Bob is cancer-free. All you want is love and a hug and prayers. That's all you need. I'll get through this. Sabra Gurch, Fox 10 News. And Bob Grinnell will have to undergo radiation to eliminate the chances of the cancer spreading. Right now, the OmniGuide is being used for nasal, throat, and neck cancers. If you'd like more information on it, visit our website, myfoxphoenix.com.